EasyRobot.com. Personal robotics for everyone. Hey there, I'm DJ Shirts. We're going to use Cookie Monster for this demonstration. So I'm currently connected to them and I have my little Windows tablet here set up. This is a demo project that's included inside of Easy Builder. It's called Robot Cookie Monster. It's a few touches, one for each arm, one for the head. I'm going to demonstrate how to use the HTTP server to connect to your desktop. But I added the HTTP server control and it showed me the host name of this computer, the port that I have it configured for, the uh, local and remote IP address, and I'm going to press the start button. On another tablet, I am going to connect to that IP address, 10.0.0.103. There we go. So it's going to prompt me for a username. All right, typed in admin, press your login button. It gives us a menu for movement, remote control, image view, session list. Movement allows you to be able to use these little buttons here to control a movement panel, whatever kind of movement panel you actually have on your master project. So when I press these buttons here, I'm moving my robot. The main form on your master are also lighting up to tell you that movement is occurring. Back at the main menu, we can now go into remote control. So now what I could do is I can actually select something on here and it moves it on there. When I update this, which is inside of a web browser, you're going to see the master update also. So I'm going to move his arm up to here. As you see, I just updated that also. Let's get out of here back to the main menu. Image view allows you to be able to see the image of your robot's camera if your robot has one. Cookie Monster doesn't, so we're going to add one on this control. And I'm going to select the camera that's built into this actual device here. Let's go back to our web browser and let's press our image view button. So what you see is the same image that is inside of your main instance and uh, in this case I can push the enable streaming button and actually start updating the image in real time. So there we go. So now that up, that image is being updated towards whatever is going on on the other device. So you can see both cameras are doing and displaying the exact same thing. Just that uh, one is over a web browser and the other one is the actual real version. You can also change the size of the image that you're viewing. So the web server allows you to control anything that's happening in your Easy Builder instance. So you can control your robot with any web browser on any device anywhere in the world. That includes uh, Firefox, Chrome, um, it also includes using your uh, like an iPhone, an Android phone, uh, Internet Explorer, your Windows computer, at work, anything. So you can control your Roomba, you can control your robot, you can control everything remotely without having to install any applications. You can get the library, connect to your computer at home, and drive your robot around.